wanted that. Up, oh, see ya. Hey, how's it going, everybody? This is Glenn Games 360. We are jumping right into <laughs> Breath of the Wild. That's right, folks. We're going to be playing one of my, probably my favorite Zelda game of all time. I have played quite a few of them. I have not played all of them, but I have watched other people play all of them. So I feel like that qualifies me as a little bit of an expert. Uh, Breath of the Wild is obviously my favorite. Um, I'm going to be setting some limitations on myself. Um... I'm not going to, like, read every little thing. I'm not going to go into every little temple. In fact, I'm going to probably not go into any of the shrines. So if you guys are looking forward to seeing the shrines, um, I'm probably not going to be going into any of those. Link, open your fart. Your heart. Um, yeah, I'm probably not going to be going into any of the shrines. I'm not going to be going out of my way to get any of the Korok seeds. Um, if I come across them, I'll get them, but I'm not going to be really going out of my way. Open your eyes, Link. She does not sound very in distress, given her, her current situation. Wake up, Link. Drink the blue slime, Link. It's tasty. It tastes like raspberry Kool-Aid. The one, one of the bigger issues that I've had with this game is I don't really like the way Link looks. I think Zelda looks cute, but she's, she looks kind of young. In fact, I think she's only said, they said she's only like 17 or something in this game, which is kind of a letdown. Um, and I don't really like the fact that they make her like absurdly weak, uh, except for in the final scene. I don't want to give away too much spoilers. Um, if you guys haven't seen Breath of the Wild yet being played or don't know what the ending is, um, it's been almost two years. This game's been out, so, or like a year and a half, so, um, I feel like there's definitely ways for you to go find out what the ending is by this point. Um, I'll try not to spoil too much, but there's really not a whole lot to spoil here. Um, so I gotta get my bearings about me. That's, that's run, that's, do that. Okay, so there's jump in this game, which is kinda cool. Look at me, I'm leaping! I'm leaping, I'm leaping! Woohoo, woohoo! Ten lords are leaping. All right. Open the door, Link. I don't know how. I just woke up after a hundred years, and I'm leaping. Link, pick up the Wii tablet. I mean, pick up the Sheikah slate. That is a Sheikah slate. Take it. It will help guide you after your long slumber. Doesn't she sound like just way too calm for the predicament that she's in right now? If you guys happen to know what's going on in the game later on. Whoa, shit, look at this. I could play all kinds of cool apps and games on this. <laughs> I'd love for him to, like, push the button and be like, shit, even our future nothing works. Open sesame. And this is the part where you're supposed to pick, pick stuff up and throw it. And push blocks and all other good stuff. Trousers? Open inventory. Sure. So, I've played this game. I'm pretty damn good at it. I could be playing this on Master Mode, completely honest with you guys. But I don't really want that kind of frustration. Part of this game is the beauty of just playing it and exploring. Like, I'd say exploring is probably one of the... <laughs> Oops! Exploring is probably one of the best parts of this game. Gotta get the camera angles down right. Wee. Oh, he's like. 
Look at him, he jumps like a fucking... Like, uh, 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 uh. Hold the Sheikah slate up to the pedestal. You're not the boss of me, you can't tell me what to do. We'll show you the way. Actually, I am the boss of you. Oh fuck, the game's become self-aware. We need to get out of this dank cave. They do this shit on purpose. They did it also in Red Dead Redemption 2, by the way. They start you out in a really, like, bleak area, like the snowstorm, or in a cave, or whatever. And then once you go outside, it's like, oh, and the angels start singing, and the light shines from the heavens. Oh, shit. What the hell's that big bright thing in the sky? You're on an alien planet, Link. Link, you are the light. Our light. That must shine upon Hyrule once again. It sounds like a lot of responsibility. Now go. You go. Oh, fine, I'll do it. I guess I'll go save you for the millionth time. Yay, jump around in the puddles. Okay, guys, this is going to be the next 15 minutes is me jumping around in the puddles. Hope you guys don't mind. This game's so fucking awesome. There's a reason why this is one of my top three favorite games. Resident Evil 4 is also one of my top three favorite games. And they're co it's coming to the Switch. Yay! I already have the HD version on Steam, which I've been playing. You guys can go check that out. Um, I've been playing with beats in the background instead of, like, the dreary darkness man that's so beautiful that's that's an epic view man game developers did a very good job and give me the okay sign they did a very good job when they put in this overlook to give you kind of an idea of the scope of the world then you could fall right down that fucking cliff and break your neck <laughs> look at me I'm the old man looking pretty good for a ghost Oh shit, I wasn't supposed to do that. <laughs> oh fuck. Oh, come on, game. It's supposed to be open world. I'm supposed to have the freedom to do what I want. Well, I guess Ganon wins. Tips and tricks. It's just the tip. And the tip is to aim your control. Your control stick. Make sure you waggle it in all the right directions. Okay, so that's what you're not supposed to do. What do we got over here? What do we have over here? Oh! It's got question marks on it. I've never seen a tree before. I guess we'll just take this until... Until we get something better. Get some shrooms. Some of them sweet, sweet Hylian shrooms. So I can go anywhere I want except for down there. Whoa. Sorry if any of you guys out there have vertigo. Hmm. There we go. That's what I was trying to do. My stamina sucks balls. Whew, made it. I love how it's like teaching me the tutorial and I already know this shit. What can we see from up here? Well, there's a lake. And there's a little lizard. Got him. Can I get this one? I can't, I'm sure I can't get this one. Ooh, I see some moblins. Or no, wait a minute, I forgot what the things are called. They're not moblins, they're something else, I think. Oh, by the way, I have the uh, the HUD off, so I so you guys can see the full view grandeur of the game here. That's awesome and fucking epic right there. 
Link. 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 Yes. Head I for hear the you. point marked on the map in your Sheikah slate. Oh, wow, she's well in the know, man. She knows exactly what's on that Sheikah slate. I bet she has all her downloaded porn on the Sheikah slate. Like, Link, pay no attention to the folder marked XXX. Follow the Sheikah slate. Go here. Got it. Which is to the, my right, which is the way that the game wants me to go, but I ain't feeling it just yet. Let's see if I can go stir up some trouble without getting myself killed. See, I don't have any bombs or anything yet. I just have my wits. <laughs> I love how the game's auto-saving in the corner over there. That wasn't helpful at all. Oh man, I wanted that. Up, oh, see ya. Okay, I got no weapon now. So, that could be kind of problematic. Is there anything I can use as a weapon? These guys don't have any weapons either, so that's kind of lame. I'll be back for you guys, don't worry. I just gotta squirrel, steal this nut from this squirrel over here. I really needed to pick up that club, apparently. Oh well. Link 1, enemy 0. What do we have up here? Anything I can kill those fools with? Can't really go in the snow area. It's kind of funneling me over here. Ooh, look at those unsuspecting fools. Haha, they didn't see me. Time to cause some mayhem. Uh oh. Oops, they saw me. Uh, is there anything over here I can use as a weapon? Nope. See, what I meant to do is I meant to sneak up behind them and take them out with their own weapons. Helicopter maneuver. I wasn't ready for that. Okay, it looks like I'm gonna have to retreat for now because my weapon just. Well, I have no weapons. Whoa! <laughs> Alright. Run, Link, run! Run like your life depends on it. I think I remember. Yeah, there's a weapon over here. Oh, these guys are fucked. Doesn't even matter what it is. It could be a broken stick at this point. Nope. Don't want to go there. I also going to take your axe, old fool. <laughs> take my axe. Don't mind if I do. I've got a score to settle. Until the blood moon rises. Time I got my revenge. You see they picked their weapons back up. Some serious accuracy for that jump and like mid-air jump. 
I gotta figure out. There we go. That's how I'm supposed to do it. You didn't see that one coming. They never do. I'll take that. No, I don't want to do that. Chopped him down. Got my torch. Gonna get my barrel. Pick up a couple monster parts. Come back, barrel. Ah, it's gone. It gone. What else did they leave me up here? What other kinds of goodies? No weapons. Because they're a bunch of a-holes like that. Ah. Looks like the barrel's not completely gone. Mm-mm. Roasted duck. A roasted bird. I do believe that's my baked apple. <laughs> you want to fight me for it, old man? I've killed ghosts before in the past. I'm not afraid to do it again. Thank you. <sighs> I didn't want to hear that shit anyway. Bye. <laughs> hey, well, do as you like, then. <laughs> sure, what is this place? Great Plateau... I don't want to find out what happens if I don't answer his questions properly. Over there is the Temple of Time. Except it doesn't tell time. It doesn't really do much of anything related to time. Well, anything else you can tell me? What are you doing? Relaxing by the fireside, of course. Yeah, I guess I probably should, huh? Hmm. Well, I already have one roasted apple. And I don't have any more. I thought I picked up a whole bunch of them. I must have eaten them or something. Oh, no. There they are. Look at Link one hand and then those apples. <laughs> uh, oh, Link. He cracked me up. They're burning! Alright, see you, old dude. Let me know if you come up with anything useful. around here. I could go down this way. I am a friend to the animals, except for in this game. Link is the absolute killer of the wild. Ooh, he almost had me there for a second. Keep going, Link. You ain't safe yet. Oh, no, he did not. Still kind of getting the hang of the controls again. It's been a little while since I've played this. <laughs> oh well, that was my only weapon. I guess I better go find something else. Aha, I got the ancient screw. 
that's what happens in the retirement home. I never did quite figure out what those butterflies are all about. Hmm. My problem is I need to go find myself a weapon so I can go get more weapons. Maybe I can kill some guys down here and I can grab their weapons. That's not what I wanted to do. Two for two, baby. Your soul is mine. Oh, man, I love this game so much. It's so much fun, so beautiful. And it kind of even helps a little bit that I kind of forgot how to play it because it adds a kind of little bit of a challenge here at the beginning. This is the part that Reggie showed off on uh, Sean Fa uh, Jimmy Fallon, I believe. Hope you fellers enjoyed your last meal. Oh, got him with a twofer. Your soul is mine. I forgot how many great things you can do in this game. There we go. Poof. Into a ball of flames. Anytime you're ready. Oh, no, I lost whatever was in there. Alright, I guess we should probably go investigate the Temple of Time, huh? See what kind of bullshit's waiting for me up there. You guys already know, man. I'm all about that sneak factor. Dude had no idea what the hell was going on. Link, destroyer of the wild, has struck again. Sweet lube, that blue lube. What else did you guys think they used for lube in that time period? And this guy right here, he has no idea what's coming. Well, somebody's been keeping up on the shrubbery work, so that's nice. You know, it's the end of the world and Ganon's in charge, but you've got to make time to garden. Sweet ancient screw. That's the most, that's the screw that's been through the most. Nothing right here. Looks like I'm not quite in the Temple of Time just yet. That's just the outer part of it, I guess. Run, Link. You run like a little bitch. Actually, he's kind of hauling ass. It's just the world that's big. It's not the size of the world that matters. It's how you use it. Said no open open world game player ever. Oh, I really wanted to do a ninja strike on him. Later in the game when I get the ninja gear, that's totally what I'm going to be doing. 
that's that ancient gear. That's like the, the original Metal Gear Solid or Metal Gear game. That's that ancient gear. Hey, mommy, what's up, mommy? Okay, no need to pray just yet. We gotta pray just to make it today. Pray. I forgot who made that song. If you guys are liking this, and if you're still watching this video even after all this time, uh, thank you for joining me. This is Gun Games 360. Um, thank you very much for joining me, and please remember to subscribe if you have not. Please like and comment. I love hearing from you guys. I love responding. Um, I try to get back as quickly as I can. I'm a very busy man, but I always try to make time to respond to the comments when I can. I am in my last five and a half weeks of nursing school. Um, in addition, I'm also taking a Spanish 101 course, which is required for my um, degree. So it's one of those last minute things I had to get taken care of. That's the bow I was talking about. Link, draw your bow. Link takes out a notebook and a pen. Okay. Now, I said I wasn't going to go after the Korok seeds, but there's this one that I really like to get to because mostly it's not for the Korok seed, though. Hopefully, I have enough stamina to make it. That's what Link sounds like. That's why I like coming to this spot. Because Link's hanging out like a tree monkey. It's a beaut, ain't it? By the way, these Korok guys are always in very uh, scenic locations. No, I'm not Hestu. Hetsu. Hestu. I'm not Hestia either. If I was, I'd never leave the house. That's a is it wrong to pick up girls in the dungeon joke and a Beavis and Butthead joke in one, so you guys get your money's worth on this show. I don't want to talk. Twee hee hee. Twee hee hee. North, south, east, west. North, south, east. That's so you can get the most advantageous pose. There you go. All right, time to get the hell out of here. Oh, shit. Oh, I thought that was going to kill me. I'm surprised it didn't, honestly. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, good thing I hit that little tile thing on the way down. Where's Damp the Gravekeeper? I'm pissed he's not in this game. Ooh, more pots. I'm like a kid in a candy store. I'm like, ooh! What's this? Aw, oh, sweet, man. I came back here and found some arrows and shit. Some bomb arrows, some regular arrows. It's it's game over for these dudes, man. I already got weapons. I already got health. Where should I go to next? The world is now open before me. I saw that skull thing over here. Alright, now I thought I saw some of these things. That's what I saw. Okay, so it's not... what I thought it was. Um. Oh. Nothing to see here, guys. <laughs> Oops.
these these dorks over here have no clue. <laughs> okay, this might take a second, but I have a plan. See if I could be very stealthy and sneaky about it. Can you suckers climb? No, but they can throw rocks. Alright, you guys go back to what you were doing before. Uncle Link's got us a, got a present for you. Oh, that's right, baby. It's time. I wonder if the arrow could just blow up in your, in your bow. Look at that. In the light and over to the darkness. The light side and the dark side. Use the force, Link. I want to see if I can hit that. Hit that. Booyah! That's how I roll, man. A little bit of well-calculated attacks, and you can do some big things in this game. Now i got to try to grab that weapon and put it out before the fire consumes it. Grab that sweet, sweet meat. I love to eat that meat. You gotta beat the meat first, though. Tenderize it. Sweet, got another bow. I got all kinds of good stuff over here. I'll get that last. I want to get whatever's behind this little area over here. Oh, it looks like there's a bee's nest in there. Um, where's my arrows? I hate B's and I hate C's and D's and here they come eat some of those sweet sweet green stamella shrooms yep. got five bomb arrows yeah buddy we're on a roll now. Let's go get that treasure chest that I earned. Got a sweet throwing spear. I think I can make probably some room in my inventory. I don't really need uh, any... I don't really need the torch at this moment, so... I'd much rather have a throwing spear. Oh, I wish I had the parachute, the paraglider. That's gonna be dope later in the game. Alright guys, well it's a big world in front of us and I hope you guys enjoyed this playthrough as much as I did. I'll see you guys in the next video. Please remember to like, subscribe, and comment. Also check me out on Wolfenstein. I'm having a great time playing that as well. Uh, check out my channel if you haven't already. So anyway, bye you guys. Thank you very much for joining me.